Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope that you all are having a wonderful day and that you watch this video till the very end. It's true, there's a monster in my house. I don't know how it suddenly disappeared, but I really saw it. It was so scary. Why does no one believe me? Do you feel terrified when you see monsters? Of course. I... It's okay. You'll soon forget all of this. Forget all these terrifying memories. We leave the rest to him. Yeah. After all, only the few of them are able to carry that kind of thing around. That's true. Most people in the watch probably find it intolerable. Though I don't really care. Is it done? Yes, my work here is done. Please submit a detailed report of this case. The watch, logistics, memory eraser specialist. Oh, sorry, did I expose you to the sun? So you were on this side. Sorry, I didn't know. Oh yeah, the sun's almost out. It'll be unbearable for you soon. I brought it with me, you see it, right? I'm sorry. With it, I verified that the lady can no longer see death leaves, so I erased all of her recent memories straight away. Please don't worry, it's a low-level death leaf that has been tamed and trained by the watch. It won't cause any harm to humans, and it's only here for our daily verification work. I've heard about it before, but this is the first time I'm seeing it. You can't see it, right? Isn't it inconvenient for you? Tail. It's fine, actually. As long as it's trained, I can communicate simple instructions to it through the nether belt. Moreover, it's pretty mild in nature. The only thing is, it's more afraid of light because it's a low-level death leaf. It's a good boy. It's quite pleasant to work with. We have a good relationship, haha. <laughs> no, it's secretly plucking your hair. Contemplating if she wants to break his beautiful fantasy. Stop plucking, he'll go bald. Concerned. Actually, I would like to know. That lady has clearly never seen death leaves before. How does an ordinary person like her suddenly gain the ability to see death leaves and then suddenly lose it? In my previous experiences, there have been very few cases where adults can still see death leaves. If only we can find the cause behind this. Do you have any ideas? Forty minutes ago. Please, Mumu. Bai Wen injured his hand. I'm going with him to get it treated. Please help me hide his present from the watch temporarily. Pretty please? No, let go. That'd be obstructing governmental administration. You won't have to do it for too long. I'll bring him to the watch once my master comes back. Your master, really? Really, really, really. She gave in and agreed in the end. <clears throat> I wasn't the one who took out the death lead this time. It was Yohua Ran. The Yu family. That the... Ah, sorry. If that's the case, I'd have to ask her to report the details of this case to the watch. There's no need. She still isn't a member of the watch. I'll ask her about the details and make the report. Very well, if you say so. If there is nothing else, I'll be going back to report on the completion of my work.
Okay, thanks for the hard work. Momo. Ah, uh, I know. You can protect your Horon forever, right? But it's so rare for my friend to ask me for a favor. I have to help her. But what did you mean before when you said the watch will punish her? The watch has no authority to do so towards non-member civilians though. Or else that brat wouldn't be able to remain so unrestrained for so long. See episode 2. Well, that child is too mischievous and causes us too much worry. I was just scaring her. I didn't know you were so evil. That was probably just my imagination. After all, if it were a memory-tempering spell cast by a living person, I'd definitely be able to detect it with my ability. Ah! Mom, that's my friend! Huh? Wait! Don't run in the road! Huh? Jeez, I told you not to run! Come on, get up. The light's about to turn red. Are you hurt anywhere? Seriously, no more next time, okay? Don't run in the road.